Jessies. Welcome to Thick Girls Guide. In today's video, we are going to be going over a new Lane Bryant haul. Very excited. So I got about 10 or 11 pieces for this haul. Um, a lot of it's very fall um, oriented since all of that goodness is starting to come out. So super excited for that. Um, and so yeah, if you want to see what I got from Lane Bryant, sorry, my dog is, you know, barking a fool. He's a Pomeranian. That's what they do. Okay. They're just cute and they bark. That's it. Um, anyway, hum boo boo. Anyway, so any who's it back to uh, the haul here. So yeah, everything's kind of more um, fall esque. Um, I've also got some like athleisure pieces, a couple dresses, a pair of jeans. So a good variety of things to show you. And I will be going over like all the fabrics and the prices and obviously trying everything on for you. So if you want to see that, stick around. And don't forget to join the Hussy Gang and hit that subscribe button and give this video a big thumbs up. Let's get into it. So first things first, let's run through um, what I got or what I picked up. So the first thing, I don't know if this is, I'm going to do a fall trends video, by the way, for um, the upcoming season um, and kind of what to expect. But one of the things is there's going to be a lot of denim. So denim shirts, a lot of denim jackets. This is kind of a denim peplum top and it was very different. So I was like, I need to try it and see if it's cute, you know, it's a different type of style that I was like, it's unique. Let's try it out. Uh, the next thing I got was just this cute kind of graphic tee, obviously it says icon. And then kind of into the, like the athleisure. These are the Livy leggings. These are the cropped leggings. So they're um, not a full length, but I loved the print of it, the colors, um, the gray background. I typically do love how the Lane Bryant leggings fit in general. To me, they're they have not been surpassed yet. <laughs> um, and I typically, for, for uh, different brands, will try different leggings to see if they stack up or if they're better. And I gotta say the quality of the Lane Bryant leggings cannot be beat yet. So many have tried, they have all failed. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> so the next thing I got is this cute little, it's kind of got like a little puff sleeve with some crochet detail here, um, t-shirt just in this really pretty ivory color. Next up, I did get a pair of straight leg denim. This is from the brand 77, um, which is my favorite um, brand of denim. The straight leg and the boot cut are coming back for the fall. So it's kind of out with the skinny and with the wider leg or the looser leg. Um, are the trends that are kind of coming out. So I thought, okay, let me get a pair of straight leg. I am not willing to do boot cut yet. I think that's too wide. Um, it makes me look like a brick. Um, I have preferred skinny jeans for years now. So for me to break out of that, it's gonna be pretty difficult. So next item is this kind of t-shirt dress and it is kind of a midi length. And it has rouging on the side here, um, the shorter sleeve, and just kind of a basic gray. So I think that we can do a lot with that. So I've got a few ways to style this that I will also show. Next, I'm obsessed. Um, I love bomber jackets. <laughs> In fact, I live in a kind of jacket damn near, but this one in particular is, I think this is from the Livy. No, it's not. It's just a, it's a, so it's a little bit cropped. It's got kind of a, I don't even know what kind of pattern this is. Borderline maybe snakeskin. Um, but we've got the dramatic collar. It comes with pockets. <sighs> Y'all, I love, love, love a jacket. I have tons of them and I can never like stop buying them. Like it doesn't matter if I have 50, it does not matter. I'm still buying more <laughs> because I don't have one like that. You know what I mean? 
That's my justification. Don't judge. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> the next thing I got is this cute little athleisure outfit. So we've got like the tie dye, the coral navy and kind of gray top here. And that goes with the cute little sweatpant joggers. Um, so I'll show you kind of how to style that as well. I know athleisure has been in for a while. It's been a hard style for me to get behind because I feel like I'm wearing pajamas out the house. So will I wear that out the house? Probably not. <laughs> I don't know. I just, I just feel maybe too casual, I think. I don't know. But I feel like if you're going to do athleisure outside the house, do it right and do the style right to where you don't look like you just like rolled out of bed and like went to the store. I don't know. I just, I cannot leave the house looking a mess. That's just me. <laughs> All right. And the next item that I picked up is another pair of leggings. Um, so it's a darker gray and then we've got these beautiful like kind of abstract type floral pattern it does have pockets they are also a cropped kind of length and they have um, the crisscross detail on the end there of the leg super excited to try these out um, it's such a cute pattern and I was like I cannot pass that up uh, the last item that I got, which I'm probably, I don't know if I'm more excited for this or the bomber jacket, but this really pretty floral dress. I love the pattern and the print. The style of it is so cute. We have like a little drawstring, some little kind of ruffles here, um, button detailing down the front. This will help to emphasize the waist. Stunning romantic floral for fall, spring, every single second of my life. <laughs> so very excited to try that out. Let's get into the try on portion, which is the fun part. So this dress is the mock neck rouged side um, Seth dress. So it is pretty form fitting as you can see. Um, I ended up sizing up on this because I did not want it to be skin tight. I'm glad I did uh, because on the model it's it looks very fitted here. So I sized up to a 26, 28 in this one. Gl again, glad I did. So this is normally $69.95 and it is rayon and spandex. Let me adjust the camera because I do have uh, since it's kind of like a, I would say a more casual dress, I did pair it with my white Chuck Taylors. Um, and I'm going to so show you how I would style it as well. Okay, so I've got the Chucks on with it. It's a little bit more sporty. Um, you can see it does hit right, right below my knee. You can also kind of pull it down a little bit. If you wanted it a little longer, you could do that. Um, so it goes maybe like another inch or so down. Um, the side there, but she makes the, the booty look good though. Okay. So this is the, the, um, bomber jacket as well. So I'll go over the information for this in a minute, but this is what I would wear, how I would wear it with the Chuck Taylors. So super cute. All right. So the bomber jacket is called the on the go bomber jacket. And as you can see, it's kind of more of a cropped length. Um, it has a zipper closure and it's a nylon and spandex blend. There's also pockets here. They, they're like a zippy pocket. Um, it's very comfortable. This is a size 22 um, and it is a snake print. So I did figure that out on the website because it's kind of like, it kind of looks like a snake skin, but it kind of doesn't. So this could be used with like jeans. Um, you could wear it with a dress like this. Like I just love these kind of jackets, particularly the a little bit more cropped length on me uh, looks good because that's my smallest part. Um, and yeah, it's very comfortable material. 
Uh, this jacket is $109. Um, I did catch it on a sale. Don't think I paid that for it. Wait for a sale. <laughs> but I will absolutely be keeping this because it is so freaking cute. I love it. So this dress is the sleeveless notch neck fit and flare dress from Lane Bryant. It is $79.95. And it comes about right to my knee. Um, so it's a decent length. Okay, so it does have a little tie up here at the neck, so you can undo that if you don't want it that close to your neck. Um, there's also a little black button detailing here. We have an elastic waist as well. And for the hem, there's like a little black um, crocheted uh, part here. And then on the bottom, it has like some really cute ruffles. I absolutely adore this dress. Um, so I would wear it just like this, put on some cute sandals with it, wear it to an event, whatever. Now, if you wanted to dress it down, make it a little bit more casual, let me show you how to do that. All right, so if you wanna calm it down a little bit and um, make it a little bit more uh, casual, you can always do my favorite trick, which is pair it with a jean jacket and some super cute, let me get back far enough, white sneakers like uh, Converse, uh, or I call them Chuck Taylors, or like little Keds or something like that. So that's kind of a way to make it a little bit more sportier, a little bit more versatile, so you can wear it, you know, get some more wear out of it. Okay, so this is my little athleisure look for y'all. Um, so these pants are called the Livy French Terry Capri Jogger. They're in a light gray, and then of course you can see they have the kind of matching stripe down the side. These are 22.24. And then of course I paired them with a Chuck Taylor sneaker. Um, you can do, you know, any other kind of sneaker. I would, I would just, these are the ones that I have. I don't have many sneakers, but these are the ones that I have. I also have a darker gray, so that might work with them, them as well, or if you have a black sneaker. The joggers are $59.95. They have an elastic waist and a drawstring, a functioning drawstring. And then they do kind of have a, like a band that goes around the calf muscle as well. Both the pants and, or the joggers and the top are a cotton polyester blend. Shh, be quiet. Both the joggers and the top are a cotton polyester blend, uh, which brings me to the next thing, the top here. So this is the Libby short sleeve sweatshirt in a tie dye uh, pattern. And the top is $54.95. I love the pattern of it. So super cute together. Um, definitely, uh, you know, obviously if you go out in this, you look uh, definitely more put together than if you're rolling out in some like Tweety Bird pajamas or something. Um, so if, if you insist on wearing pajamas out of the house, do some type of athleisure wear, please. <laughs> uh, anyway, a little bit of judgment there, sorry. <laughs> anyway, yeah, the top is $54.95, and then this is a $22.24, and then also the joggers are a $22.24. And it does have kind of like on the side, it has like this little notch thingy, notch out thing there. So, but overall, both are very, very comfortable, um, and I will definitely keep them. So this top is the smocked peplum button-down top. Obviously it's a denim. Um, I did try to size up in this, so I went with like a 26 because I wanted it to be a little bit longer to kind of wear it as a more of a tunic. It's not quite long enough in the back to do that, but it's actually still a cute top. Um, I do wish, like it buttons all the way up and that's just like, that's too much for me. <laughs> I don't like things near my neck. So what I would probably do was to be like, you know, starch and iron it open here so that it's not as up on my neck. So it does have the smocking here. 
Um, what I love that you could do with this is, while I have like this fun printed legging with it, and this is one of the things you could do with it, and then I just have like a little black sandal on with it. But the other thing for fall that you could do would be like just a plain black legging, some knee high like cognac colored boots, and then a fun scarf. So that would be really, really cute as well. And that's probably how I would wear it more so than with these bright leggings. Um, this top is $59.95 and it's 100% cotton. These leggings, these go up very high, <laughs> uh, but they are the Livy High Rise Wicking Capri Legging with pockets. So they do have pockets here and on this side. This is the splatter paint print. It does come in a bunch of other prints as well. So there's kind of like a, almost like a tie dye -y one. I think there's one that's like, um, like a, some kind of black or gray print to where it's like very subtle. And then there's, I think a leafy type of fall print as well. So if you like them, but you don't particularly like this pattern, they have other options. Um, these are a poly spandex blend. And then these are $49.95. Okay, so these leggings are the Livy High Rise Wicking Capri Legging with pockets and hem de detail. And they're a super fun gray and floral print. And as you can see, there's like a crisscross kind of hem detail on the back. And how I would wear it is you can wear it just, you know, with a regular tee. For this one to show this kind of front paneling here, I did um, kind of tie the, hand, the shirt up a little bit to make it more of kind of a, a cropped look. Um, now what I love about Lane Bryant leggings is they have this huge like paneling piece right there to kind of hold everything in. But also a lot of leggings I feel like that I've tried kind of like wiggle down throughout the day because of this paneling these stay put it does not move so you're not constantly having to pull them up or anything like that um so i absolutely love these leggings love the print of them they're always super comfortable and i will definitely be keeping these next up i have the um icon graphic high low t this is a 22 24 and as you can see, it's a little bit shorter in the front, a little bit longer in the back. Um, overall, very cute, super comfortable, classic, just graphic tee. And um, this is a 22-24, it is $34.95, and it is a cotton and uh, polyester blend. All right, so last up here, we've got the Fabric Mix Perfect Puff Sleeve Tee. And let me back up here. The 7-7 seven, seven straight leg medium wash jeans. Now the puff sleeve is 100% cotton and it has like a little elastic here with crocheting detail. And it's a little bit puffier. So super cute, um, kind of basic tee. It also comes in a baby blue color as well. This is the ivory. And it is $49.95. Now the jeans, 7.7 seven is a bit pricey, so they're $89.95. The jeans are a um, combination of cotton, elastane, and polyester. And these are a 26. 7.7 seven does run a little bit snug, um, so I just sized up a little bit. Uh, because of that, because I know that they run a little bit snug. So I'm normally a 24, went up to a 26 and they fit perfect. So, all right, so that was it for my Lane Bryant haul. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. Everything is linked down below as usual, as well as any of my measurements and all of that in case you're wondering. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button, red button right down there. And it might be this way. I don't know which way I'm filming and which way it comes off on camera, but you know, it's one of those ways. Hit it, you'll love it. Anyway, so um, hit the subscribe button, give this video a big thumbs up, and we will see you next time. Bye guys.